how to work in retirement and still have fun. This is an awesome website. And, uh, man, this place is awesome. Uh, Nancy had sent this to me. And uh, this is one of the things she and her other half is going to do when they hit the retirement bell. Ding, ding, ding. I'm out of here, boss. See ya. Take this job and shove it. Boom, boom, boom. So let's look at this. This is fantastic. It's uh, called coolworks.com. Coolworks.com. And we're going to read this article first. Then we're going to show you a bit about... about uh, Cool Works. What's the unisex short sleeve shirt? Okay, this is their stuff. Okay, gotcha. Cool Works Mercantile. Let's see. Okay, what's that about? Uh, they got the cop. That's pretty cool. Ceramic Stein? Steen? Stein? All right. Uh, so here's these happy retirees. There's some place in the mountains. That looks awesome. It looks like he's sweating a little bit there. You gotta clean that up there, dog man. All right, so let's let's uh, let's look, keep looking. How to work in retirement and still have fun from CoolWorks.com. Sure, working your retirement years can help you delay tapping into your savings. But many retired age folks choose to work in destination locations as a ways to travel, meet people, have fun, and gain new experiences. Roughly 20% of the job seekers on CoolWorks.com fall into the retirement age bracket. And whether they're looking for a fun way to see new places or do something different for just one season, uh, or they're pursuing a DIY encore career quilted together by various seasonal jobs in different states, uh, one of the most important things you should realize from the start is that you are not alone. Wow, that is a long sentence there. Good night. Need a period in there, cool works. You are not alone. There, there's a vibrant community of job seekers in their second half of life that seek out and enjoy seasonal jobs. Not only are there candidates like people or people like you work in seasonal jobs, but people in their second half of life are popular candidates among seasonal employers. Here are a few of our favorite reasons to consider exploring seasonal jobs. Live, work, and play in a new and unique setting that many people spend many years saving up to visit for a short time. Meet new people, make new friends, earn money, and leave your savings intact. Cool workers with dedication and commitment to saving have actually been able to save significantly or even pay off debt as a result of the reduced cost of living that comes along with seasonal work. We'll get in that here in just a second. Seasonal work commonly entails living on site. It's hard to overstate the savings that result from eliminating a commute to and from the workplace. There are also reduced costs of living as employers often provide room and board. Whether it's learning the flora and fauna, discovering the history of the national park you call home, or learning how to work at the front desk of a resort, there are endless opportunities to learning something new. Extended commitments are not required. Since seasonal work allows you to relocate to a beautiful place for just a season, you can leave when the snow blows in. Travel and experience incredible places from the perspective of a local, not just a tourist. Room and board, many, we already talked about that. Uh, imagine to have to, they also not, okay, many seasonal employers offer you housing as well as uh, employee dining rooms on property. Uh, imagine to have to cook a meal for or wash a dish for six months. You can stay active, enjoy physical health and a healthy lifestyle in a place where you're surrounded by opportunities to recreate and great outdoors. Are you interested in learning more and soaking in more detail about the opportunities you can find on coolworks.com to see if they appeal to you? Well, there'll be jobs interested. So let's, uh, Let's see what the jobs are they got. They got find a job. Again, it's coolworks.com. Let's just go to uh let's go to po find what's uh let's go to find a job, shall we? All right, let's see. So we got search. You can browse by states. Uh, let's look at state. Let's look at the good old state of Maine, shall we? Alaska, California, IA, Georgia, Indiana, uh Maine. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, baby. Maine, here we come. All right, so we can work at uh, Acadia Shops. There you go. Bar Harbor, Mount Desert Island in Acadia. Okay, cool. Let's check it out, man. Uh, so we got Matt Heistend, uh, jobs in Acadia at Gmail, AcadiaShops.com. Let's we'll see what they're looking for. This might be a little bit hard because of the stupid commie virus, but uh, yeah, that's fantastic. My brother's up there right now. Maybe he's not there anymore, but he was just up there last weekend. Spring, summer, and fall, staff size 50. Housing, whether included in the compensation package or provided at cost, housing is provided for staff. No meals require are, are included. Most phone carriers, and they do have internet access. We operate an apartment-style housing in Bar Harbor, which are shared by four and five employees per apartment. Apartments are 140 bucks per week per person, include complete kitchen, laundry, and internet. 
Our company housing is in walking distance. All Acadia Corporation housing is supervised. All right. You get a 40% discount on merch. Uh, monthly get functions, including lobster and steak fest. Oh, oh and turf, baby. Many tours are discounted for free. All right, cool, man. Um, you can talk about how to get there for fun. Busy record, okay. Let's see what they got for a job. They tell us what jobs are available there. I don't see any. View our jobs. Okay, let's take a look at the jobs. Oh, wait, let's go back. I got to see the pictures, man. Got to see the pictures. Oh, look up. Oh, <laughs> that was a joke. Oh, look at that. See, it's nice people working the front desk. Here we got, that doesn't look like a cool works lady, but whatever that is. Oh, that looks tasty. If you're going to show, they got to show old people working, man. Uh, old people. Retirees working. Seniors working, not young folk. Ah, oh, there you go. Look at that. Now that, my friends, what I'm talking about. Probably just heard somebody go into the pantry. Oh, yeah. Katie Shops, but they're still showing youngs. Young folks. You got to show the older folks, man. Come on. Oh, puppies. Oh. Is that poppies? No, there's some place in Maine. I think it might be blueberries. I can't remember. Oh, yeah. Look at that. All right, so let's uh let's see what jobs they have available. One second. Here's some of the jobs available: retail clerks and retail supervisory. Uh, feature gift foods made in Maine and elsewhere to highlight the region's character. A country store. Oh yeah, so you go uh outdoor apparel. You are oh here we go. View our uh. Available jobs and job description. There it is. This is what I was trying to see. All right, cool. A retail shop assistant manager, retail shop clerk, retail shop clerk, retail shop clerk. All right, let's just see what the retail shop clerk can do. Base rate is 13 bucks an hour, man. That's what I'm talking about. 13 bucks an hour to be a uh, retail shop clerk in there, and you can go work for, what, 20 hours a week or something like that? Um, yeah, shifts may require... <laughs> Heck yeah, there you go. So go work there. Uh, you know, 13 bucks an hour, you get uh, 140 bucks uh, for housing for a couple months. So 140 bucks, that's 560 a month. Um, they don't provide food, uh, but then you get all kinds of discounts and surf and turf. Yeah, nothing wrong with that. So how do you, you apply right there? There you go, cool. All right, let's see what else I got in me. So that's the uh, Acadia store. All right, so basically just working as a, a frontline person. All right, so we got college students, coaches, and teachers come to Maine. All right, we'll keep looking at that. Uh, Jordan Pond House in Acadia National Park. Retail and F&B positions and spectacular. I don't know what F&B is. Um, B Outdoors Appalachian Mountain Club. There you go. Let's ch we'll check that out. Kingsley, the way camp should be. Laurel South. I like how they got the firearms there. All right, so let's see what the this is about. Camp Laurel South. Don't, don't know anything about it. Let's check it out. They need maintenance, drivers, and food service. They need a nurse there, too. All right. Let's see what they do. And that's way over here in by Sebago Lake, I guess. All right. So housing is in, weather included in the comp. Uh, meals are provided. Housing is uh, provided for staff. There you go, man. So housing is included. Freaking how awesome is that? All right, so what do they need at this place? We're going to go to view, you know, can we just go to view jobs? Let's see what we got. We'll go to view profile. Oh, yeah. There you go. Look at that. Look at all the tennis courts. All right, about oral employee experience. Ideal candidate. We're seeking college students and teachers to lead instructor wide variety of activities. Blah, blah, blah. So it looks like it might be a little bit older for younger folks, but let's see. Uh, camp counselors. All right, culinary director of summer camp in Maine. I guess that's it, huh? Support positions, maintenance drivers. So I'd be a driver. Heck yeah. Culinary director at camp. Okay, so not much there doesn't seem. Um, all right, so they probably they probably need younger people than than us us old folks here. All right, so let's we'll, let's get out of that one. We'll keep looking. Uh, Hampton by Hilton, Bar Harbor. There you go. All right, that looks pretty cool. So maybe that'd be better. All right, so let's look at this one. Hampton. By Hilton Bar Harbor, All right? Oh yeah! Oh man, look at that! Yes, everything is right about that picture. Oh man, that's some of the pictures. Okay, so let's check this out. Uh, spring, summer, fall weather uh, housing is provided. 
whether including the compensation package you're providing at co housing is provided. Gotcha. But you don't get any meals. Oh man, what the meals, right? They're looking, what are they looking for these people here? Room and board offers limited number of our, our apartment style employee housings. First come, first serve available for plans and share rooming options begin a hundred bucks a week. Man, that's what I'm talking about. I wonder if they'll, if they'll clean your own, uh, you know, toilets and stuff like that. Or, you know, if you're like a, uh, uh, housekeeping, will they do it for you? So let's see what kind of jobs they got. View our jobs. All right, let's check this out. Uh, uh, all right, right here. Available hospital. View a complete. Okay, available hospitality jobs. Let's see what we got here. All right, sweet. Work for the best of the best. Okay, hotel housekeeping, front desk, breakfast. Oh, breakfast attendant. Serving of smile. Ready to watch this? Serving of smile. Can you, if you can do that, you can work there. Front desk super. I'm not trying to supervise anybody. I'll tell you that right now. All right, so let's see what a breakfast attendant, what kind of scratch you talk about here. Oop, uh, dead link. I hate dead links. Hate dead links. Click another dead link. Oh. It's like, uh, remember Sideshow Bob when he stepped on the uh, rakes? Oh, oh. Front desk associate. Let's see. Another dead link. Good night. Come on, Hampton. Kill me. Kill me. I'm dying. Dead link here too. Oh, there we go. Housekeeping room attendant. All right, what do we get paid here? That's what we want to find out. I could never be house housekeeping because making beds. I've never good at the army. I'll never be good at for other people. Uh, what's the what's the fee? What what are we getting paid? Uh, we offer affordable employee housing. Okay, well, I don't see any salary. I don't see anything that said a pay so all right there you go but yeah, it's kind of cool so you can look i'll put links to show us all this place right here the cool works and again nancy uh our everyone's friend nancy put that oh it looks like you just go straight to ooh, find a job mechanical or seasons all right let's find a job let's go help one and now see what we got uh housekeeper and grand teton oh man let's see i want to be a housekeeper uh, maintenance, housekeepers, crew leader in Porter, Indiana, ranch hand in Idaho, Rocky Mountain. Let's take a look at this. All right, ranch hand. There you go. Work hard and stay, work hard and play hard. Oh, look at that. Good night. Goosh. Get $1,675 a month plus tips. Some experience required. Uh, if you're hard work, energetic, want to make a positive commitment to the excellent service standards for a ranch in one of the country's most spectacular. Uh, re recreation areas, we welcome you. Uh, not a wrangler works with under the supervision of the general manager. Maintain all ranch property responds responsible cutting, splitting, stacking, fire. I can do that. General landscaping, I can do that. Watering plants, planting trees, do all that. Cleans hospitals, so basically light main schools, electrical, plumbing, carpentry. All right, okay. Yep, I'm doing it. How much to get paid again? A monthly salary for your five day work week. Room and board provided. One half. Time for extra day shifts work and sharing the tip pool based on hours work. Oh, yeah. 1600 bucks a month, and they provide you room and board. There you go, man. And you, all you got to do is work there in the summertime. That's fantastic. And I don't know where that is. Let's see if we click on this. Stanley, Idaho, wherever that is. Let me not let me. Uh... Okay. What's it doing here? What's that going to do? Okay. No. What's that do? So, oh, there you go. Top of Maps. There you go. Oh, I need to sign up for Maps of Geographic. I don't get what that is. Satellite. All right. So, there you go, man. Coolworks.com. I'll definitely put links to show notes. This looks like a lot of fun, actually. I, you could you could kill on this thing. Let me kill. It's not, not kill. I mean, talking about just have fun. You could look around here and find some awesome jobs that you could uh, enjoy, get paid, and go around the country, see different things, meet some different people. How fun is that? All right, we'll see you.